So right now there are close to 100 dogs that are ready to be adopted at Metro Animal Care and Control. Now the staff says that is far too many, but a newly added position to their team. It aims to get pets adopted and do so at a much faster rate as well. So let's go to News 2's Corey Johnson joining me in studio with all the details on this. Corey. That's right, Mark. Mac recently added a behaviorist on staff. Now, this individual's role is to now spend a lot of time with each animal already at the shelter. That time is going to be mostly spent outside of their kennel by taking walks and extended play times and observing them in other public settings. And during this time, the behaviorist will take in-depth notes on each pet to create an analysis that will ultimately determine how they should be placed, whether that be in foster care, up for adoption, or another avenue of finding them a forever home. When a cat or a dog comes in to Mac, staff say they're seeing a pattern of animals staying for about four to five months before being adopted or fostered out. Now the short term goal is to lower that stay time. Long term, uh, you know, once we kind of work past our backlog of what's already with us, um, you know, long term when an animal comes in, we're hoping the behaviorists can work with them fairly quickly um, so that we can know right away so that we're not wasting time, um, you know, placing an animal somewhere that that doesn't look like it's going to be a successful, um, successful thing. Now for more details on the newly hired behaviorist at Mac and to see the pets that are available for adoption right now at the shelter, make sure to head to the story on our website, WKRN.com. A lot of people are going to want to help out. Corey, thank you.